So yesterday I was testing my machine and I went to a setting, I wasn't sure what it was, but I'll explain it. So this is set on AC right now. Anyone can do this test. But I, what I was um, looking for is this meter, this Fluke 87, if it did total harmonic distortion, it doesn't. You need like a spectrum analyzer, something a lot fancy to figure that out. Because a lot of machines that produce power can be dirty. And no one checks it. But there's it with the glare. Uh, what do we got? Small one is red. Big one is bam. All right, so that's our volts, 120 volts, which is kind of low. It used to be around 125 or so, 124. I don't know why they lowered the voltage during the summertime. You'd think it would go up, or maybe just to load on the system with the less people here. Okay, so now I hit the Hertz button. Enter frequency 59.99. Interesting. What are we gonna do? Hit this one. Yes, percentage. Okay, it's correct. This is the percentage of the sine wave. It should be around like 50%, which is pretty good. You know, like a sine wave, your electric and single phase, it goes up and down. One, one is positive, one's negative. Up oh, more frame. So you know, bam. Let's say that's positive. Bam, negative. So you want equal distance between the uh, the waves, and that's what this shows you the percentage. I forget the exact um, term for this, but that's another good thing to you can test on your uh, generator, is that, so that means your sine wave is pretty equal, or close enough, it should be around like 50%, that's fine. You know percentage is gonna kill you. The meter could be off a percentage or two, but that's interesting. So voltage, hertz, the frequency, which is good in America. In the UK, UK, over the UK, they call my channel and they think they know anything, the UK guys. They, um, have like 50. I just made fun of them. And, uh, 49 is the percentage. Interesting, though. That's cool. They, this came out with the, uh, what was that, the fifth generation of this? And this is old. And you know it when it has that, that icon. Cool. Never knew this meter does some fancy stuff for finally figuring it out years after I got it. Basically if it read like 25 or who the hell knows, it means your power quality is trash. So this one I think was, oh, so I break into my garage. Oh, it stinks in here. But this thing, the generator was like 48, which wasn't, it's not terrible. I probably could adjust it.